Hey guys, on today's tutorial we're going to go over how to up iPhone, iPad or the latest iOS. Alright, so let's just go right into this. Um, it's the same steps for whatever you guys have. So just go into settings. On the settings you guys will see your name up here. Um, just make your there. Okay, so that's the first thing you guys should do no matter how big or small the update actually is. Go right into there, click on your name and then manually back it up through iCloud. If you guys don't have space on iCloud, just hook computer and use iTunes, which is a free program for both Mac and PC. Um, again, that's iTunes. And uh, again, you guys don't need iCloud for that. You guys can just make that back up here. All right, so once you guys do that, which I always recommend doing, just in case something goes wrong, just scroll down, go into general, and your second option will be software update. Under there, we should see this coming up. Now, some of you might see download, and then another button to install now. Um, others will just see download. So uh, this is already downloaded. The download itself doesn't take that much time because it's, since this is not a huge update, um, therefore it's not gonna take more than 30 minutes for most of you. I can see this with really slow internet, maybe your iPhone, iPad, or touch is not working perfectly. Then you guys might have some some things that are not working properly, um, it could take longer, okay? But if it, everything's working fine, it's that's just about it, okay? Once you guys tap on install now, which I won't do right now because it's just gonna restart. Well, it's gonna show me a message and then it's gonna restart. We're gonna see a black screen, Apple logo, loading bar, and that's gonna go through. Then it's gonna just restart again, and then that's it. Your update is done. This should not take you guys more than 15 minutes in general. Um, for a lot of you, it's gonna take from five to 10 minutes max. And then if you're stuck there, let's say two hours still installing, that means something went wrong, you guys will have to restore. So restore this, again, it's using iTunes on your computer, which is the best way to restore anything that will fix up anything. Um, again, restoring will delete everything from your iPhone, iPad, okay? So make sure that you guys have that backup. Anyways, I'm gonna tap on install now. It's gonna ask me for my passcode, if you guys have a passcode. Then yes, this is normal procedure. So, um, before this turns off and the video is done, if you guys have any questions, comments, you can write them down here in the comments area, and don't forget to subscribe.